Hi, I'm Rob Thurston, Commercial Director for Cybex. I'm here today at Pinewood Studios in the private conditioning studio of one of the major Hollywood blockbusters. And I'm going to be interviewing Simon Waterston, who's a trainer to many of the cast and helps prepare them for their demanding roles in this movie. Simon, so firstly as a brief introduction, perhaps you could tell us a bit about your background. So my uh, background from a very young age, I was military, so a lot of my methodology and protocols and periodization that all derives from my military background, it's kind of like in abundance in a lot of my workouts and the way that I design things. Um, I used to write a lot for um, different fitness uh, magazines from Men's Health to Men's Fitness, so I was quite prevalent on the, the writing scene. Um, and then from then I was on the London circuit as a trainer and um, basically like doing my craft and applying it in the London in the London scene and, and then I moved on to this, moved on to kind of like a lot of the, um, the film business stuff. You've trained some extremely high profile clients from the movie industry. How did you get into the celebrity circuit? Could you talk about some of the previous projects that you've worked on? So getting into this business I, I fell into it by default and that was because I was writing um, for different magazines. The studio kind of picked up on a piece that I'd written, they, um, they called me, I went in, I had an interview, the same process like anything else. The person kind of like liked me and liked my methodology and where I was coming from, especially the military background. Um, and we started, it was a six month project. And then from then on, we kind of like, um, I just kind of like carried on from there. So from the 007 thing, then I went on to different like Marvel movies, which again, very performance based, very aesthetic based. Um, Captain America with Chris Evans, Avengers, Prince of Persia with Jake Gyllenhaal and so on and so forth. And um, luckily I'm still kind of like doing what I do today. So onto the current production, Spectre 007. What were the challenges in getting the cast members into shape for this movie? So I'm in a very privileged position because obviously I've done this a few times before. So what I normally do is that I look at the, the demands that are going to be um, put upon the cast and then I work out a strategy, periodization of how I'm going to condition them to be able to perform within that role. So whether that be fighting, whether that be sprinting, whether that be like jumping over walls, getting up off the ground and I, I basically, I look at that and I devise my workout and my conditioning to their demands. Could you give us an example of the type of routines and movements used when you're training someone for an action film? So when I kind of like look at the script, I kind of like do my periodization back and I use very dynamic and explosive movements. Um, I match that to what the demands are going to be of the actor. So say for instance on a chase scene, I will use like a plyometric, kind of like into a static jump, into a sprint. So I use various multiple pieces of kit and multiple kind of like body parts. So typically this is how we would condition for um, a specific scene. First of all, 15 seconds sprinting on the treadmill. Hands on, feet on the side, moving over straight away. Movement, dynamic, on the floor. Mountain climbers. Bit of explosive, sprinting, nice and linear, lateral movement, round corners. Perfect. Obstacle. Over the obstacle, good. Back to where we was. Again, on the run again. Following the 007 filming, what's next on the agenda for you? Um, I don't know exactly what I'm going to be doing, but we're in kind of like a, a very great year at the moment where there's a lot of movies that require a lot of performance, a lot of aesthetics. So Marvel are always in town, they're always doing something, so fingers crossed, maybe I'll do something there. Thank you.